We have more on the explosion in Fountain that sent six people to the hospital with three of them life flighted out of state. One of the victims is a Bay District School employee and another a freshman at a local high school. The explosion happening Sunday morning at a house off Hearst Road. A witness says 40 year old Michelle Williams turned on the stove to make breakfast and it exploded catching the home on fire. Bay County Sheriff's deputies say they found her and Henry Williams sitting in an SUV nearby, both severely burned. Now on the scene, deputies found four other people, Karen Smith, James Smith, Grant Everidge, and the young girl in worse condition. When Bay District school officials learned of the accident, they say they immediately knew they needed to help. It's absolutely heartbreaking to think of families that are making steps towards recovery from the hurricane and then something as devastating as this happens and so many of the family members have been badly injured. So um, we're really thinking about them and just want to do whatever we can to make life a little easier. Bay District Schools is now collecting donations to help the family. They're asking for clothes for the freshman girl, including size 12 pants, large shirts, size eight and a half shoes and nine shoes, or Walmart and Target gift cards. And they're also asking for gas cards and fast food gift cards to help the family visit their loved ones recovering in the hospital. Donations can be brought to the Nelson Building on Balboa Avenue in Panama City.